Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing an e.l.f. skincare haul. I also have a couple other goodies. I've got a highlighter, I've got a primer, and I've also got some eyebrow pencils. And surprise, surprise, Elf gave me a little special pack in the mail because I put in a coupon code. It was like Elf Beauty Favorites. I'm so excited, oh my gosh. So I am going to be demoing all these things for you guys. Um, and I'm super excited. I've been waiting for this package for a while. So let's go ahead, go ahead. Let's go ahead and get on in. So the first thing I have here is this facial massager. So it's from their skincare line. <sighs> Dude, really? This packaging is so horrible. To get open. Okay. Oh wow, that looks cool. So it's like a little roller, and you roll in, I guess, your moisturizer and stuff with it. Oh, that feels really good. Mm. Oh, I bet this would really help if you had like a sore jaw. That's awesome. And then I got this to go with my um, hydrating water sheet mask. So I figured after I do the sheet mask, I can go ahead and rub all the little moisture in when it's done with this little roller ball. And I'll do a demo of that later on tonight. So this next thing I have, I'm super excited about because it's part of their Beauty Shield line, and it's a brand new line at ELF. It's basically like, protect you against the sun, protect you against pollution, um, and all that kind of stuff. So I got the ELF Beauty Shield Antioxidant Enriched Skin Protection Skin Shielding Primer. Okay, I read a little too much, but, and it's SPF 50. So it says it's antioxidant rich with carrot seed oil, vitamin E. It helps protect against environmental aggressors, pollutants, dust, smoke, and it's for formulated without parabens, sulfates, phthalates, I don't know that word, or alcohol. So this is really good. Oh my gosh, it has like an actual like drug facts on it. That's like legit. Okay, okay, Elf, okay. And this packaging is hollow. Ugh, I love hollow. Mmm. Very nicely packaged. Oh my gosh, the actual tube is holographic. Oh, sorry. I'm gonna turn my notifications off. Okay. The actual tube is holographic. It's so cute. Oh my gosh. And it says um, directions are to apply on face on clean, dry skin, wear alone or under foundation. For best results, use after the moisturizer or whatever. I put on my own moisturizer. But, let's see how it looks. Gotta break the, oh, oh! It's um, like skin color. I was not ready for that. Y'all, can you see that? It's like skin color. It smells a little bit like, um, a little bit like sunscreen. Let me clip my hair back real quick. Okay. Now I'm gonna put some of this on. It's very thick. Wow. Oh my gosh. I was not ready for that. Like, yeah, this is a uh, 
This looks like it might be a good primer. And it did say on there it's supposed to reduce the look of pores. And it's a universal color. Now, I don't know about this on darker skin tones because it's almost coming out gray on me. And the camera's not really picking it up. But it's a little bit almost too light for me. Wow, this is um this is nice. It feels very smooth. And I really I really like the scent of it. It's like yes, it's a little bit sunscreeny, but it's also some fruit that I can't name. Maybe pomegranate? I don't know. And my skin feels nice and it's a little bit sticky. More like tacky. That's nice. It is kind of clinging to my dry patches. I have some dry patches on my like forehead right here. You can't, I don't know if you can see that. But so far so good. I kind of like that. It smells really nice. Like I'm digging that smell. Okay. So next I've got the Beautifully Bare Natural Glow Lotion with Aloe in Luminous Gold. Oh, let me show you the packaging. That's what it looks like. Mm. And so this is supposed to be kind of like a primer, but more like a, um, what's it called, like a dewy primer. Add a little glow to you. Yeah, it says it creates a fresh natural glow with this hydrating moisturizing lotion or lotion. It's cute. Okay. It's kind of a really small package, like compared to the primer, it's a lot smaller. Let me see how much, how many ounces. It says this point eight glow lotion is 0.85 ounces, and the Skin Shield primer, Beauty Shield primer is 1.01 ounces. I don't remember the price of these, so I'll put that down below. But it seems kind of weird. That's so small. Oh, and it's a twist off cap. I thought it was going to be another pump. Okay. Let's smell this one because you know I like to smell things. Oh. Okay, this one again is not clear. It isn't necessarily skin color, it's like ivory. This one doesn't really have a smell. I don't see any like shimmer in it or anything. So let's see if it has any shimmer. May not. Actually, no. This one smells more like sunscreen than the sunscreen did. Oh. Oh, I like this. Oh, yes. I like this. Oh, my gosh. It just gave me, like, a really pretty glow. Because that uh, Skin Shield Primer was definitely mattifying. Oh my gosh, this is really nice. It's quite glowing. I'm digging it. That was pretty. So next, I'm going to go in with another highlight. I got the um, Shimmering Facial Whip in Lilac Petal. Because everybody says this is like such a good little cheap highlighter. So I really wanted to try it. Let's do a little of the nose. Because I love my nose highlight. Oh yes, honey. Yes. Ooh, that was a little too much. Okay, so it is a little like pinky. So I don't know if I would put it on my bare skin because it's a little, it's like making my nose look a little red. It may not be one that you want to put on um, your nose. Let's see how it goes on the cheeks. It is, since it's peachy, I should have gotten a different color. Shoot, maybe I'll get a different one. Oh wow, that's beautiful. Yes. Since it is peachy, this might be more of a like blush kind of color. So you may not want to put it on your nose just because it's gonna make your nose look pink. Next, we've got my two eyebrow pencils. Now, this is my absolute favorite eyebrow pencil in um, deep brown has a spoolie on one end and then the pencil on the other and the pencil's really thin and then I saw this um, wax pencil 
and I got kind of curious about it, so I never tried this one. And I figured since I like the other uh, brow pencils so much, I would probably like this one. So I'm going to try this one out on camera, and if it doesn't go well, I got my staple. So that's okay. So if y'all can see, this one is, the big one is the wax, and the small one is the pencil. I'm going to use the spoolie from the pencil, just because that's what I usually do with my eyebrows, and I'll brush them up. Oh wow, that's very pigmented. So here are the brows done. They are a little heavy without any of my other makeup on, um, but I might just have to go in with a lighter hand. And I did really like it. It kind of saves you the step of doing um, the brow pencil and then the brow gel. It's kind of all in one, and I feel like my brows are pretty locked in place. And so now we're gonna get into um, the rest of the stuff that came in that free pack. So basically what I did was I went and looked like I search on Retail Me Not and stuff for coupons for stuff before I get stuff online. So I searched like e.l.f. coupons and it came up with get a free beauty set if you order like, I think it was like $25 or more or something. And so I'm gonna go try and find that coupon code for you guys and I'll put it down in the description box below. Um, I hope it's still working, fingers crossed, because I have the exact prices of everything and it was about $13 for this complete set. It came with the baked highlighter and bronzer which is $4. came with the cream eyeliner in black which is $3. came with the makeup mist and set spray. I've heard this is really good too. This is $3. And then it also came with a matte lip color in tea rose and that's $3 as well. But we're going to go ahead and get into the um, highlight and break and break and bake bronzer. So I got my little highlighter brush here. It's not like, you know, we didn't have enough highlight. Let's put some more on. This is one of those things where it has like a sheen first. I think it might be. This is like stiff. Let me wipe it with a tissue for a second. Hold on. Let's try that again. definitely a natural highlight and something that you probably will have to build up but for the look I'm going for today which is pretty dang natural I would say I'm digging it and now let's try some of that bronzer I'm a little scared okay well I mean it I mean, it did something. I ain't mad at it. So we're gonna take this gel eyeliner. Wow, it's really soft. I'm surprised. Okay guys, and since we're already zoomed in, I'm going to go ahead and go in with that matte lip color in Tea Rose. It's a little bit of a muted purple, but I'm digging it. Hey guys, last step, we're going to do that mist and set. Ah! I'm not even putting it at me. I can't tell if it's like coming, it wasn't even going on me, that was weird. Like, it sprays up and down, so maybe I have to go like that. sprays a lot. So this is the final look guys. I really enjoyed all of these products. 
um, this is a nice like everyday summer look for glowy skin. So um, thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a comment down below if you enjoyed. Subscribe, like, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!